Hey guys, cool blind my back. I'm Rick. Eric. Aaron. I'm Calvin. We're here with a movie reaction, and this time on Parasite. The Maximum. No. 2019 oh. Parasite. I don't know this. I have no idea what this movie's about. I don't know either. I know it was like it either won or was nominated for like one of those big award things where like they're always like, haha, La La Land, you know? Oscars? I don't know whichever one movies get the award. I believe it won an Oscar. I always forget what the which ones are which. And it's a big deal because it's an international movie. This is Korean. Emmys are TV. Emmys are TV. Yeah. Uh-huh. Movies are Oscars. Uh, Grammys. Golden Globes. What's Grammys. Golden Globe for? Uh, both. Both. Like you can win movie or TV. It's like getting your peanut butter and my chocolate. Grammys are music. Wrong about that. Is that hey, right? yeah. we're gonna be reading this movie. Oh. It's in sub, Aaron. I don't think I'm gonna take any notes sure. then. You can take some notes. No, because I'll be distracted. I'll look just down. Just don't look I'm down. I'm gonna miss more than what I missed. Just write down and look up. Oh, just gonna... like we do in the theaters. I'll just absorb it all. Used to do. This Guys, way. we have occasionally done something sub. It's not something that we're used to, so please forgive us if any problems or mess ups or anything like that. But. So many of you at patreon.com slash blindwave has said, we want you guys to react to this movie, and damn it, we're doing it. So, But again, I have no idea what this is. Yeah, I'm Assuming there's a bug? I'm familiar with this movie because of academic purposes. So mm. I've seen quite a bit of it, but yeah. not all of it from start to finish. Sure. You had to teach this? I did not. I learned. You learned this? <laughs> I learned. It learned. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I have no really real assumptions. Yeah. Um, you know what I do know? I know that our battery percentage is at 69%. <laughs> nice! <laughs> they changed the password? Yeah, I pretend to see. <laughs> That's a cave cricket. Hey! <laughs> Oh, uh, look at that toilet! I've seen this. Coffee Land 2G. Why is your toilet up like that? Is that where they poop? It's a high efficiency. Oh, dude, I'm fucking great at this. Fuck. I beat my manager at Papa John's, and he was like, competition, dude. Um. <laughs> but what if it kills you? I don't think they know they're down there, right? That's a bad idea. It'll kill you too. Yeah, it could have been 25%. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be a gremlin? So cool. Oh. It's a rock? Hmm. Material. <laughs> Food would be better than a rock. Get some money. English tutor, is that what you said? So he wants a friend that won't betray him. Or has no chance. Sure. <laughs> mm. I don't Fake a university yep. ID. <laughs> nice house. What the? It's a suction cup arrow. Why? I thought she was just hitting the top of the door frame like I used to every time I would go through another one. But no. A doggy. <laughs> Is it okay with you? Gotta be able to do the job. Sure. Heart rate. Heart rate. Heart rate. 
This man's fighting a war with his test. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the heartbeat. Heart doesn't lie. They're like Dracula and Van Helsing. You can almost dance to the beat. <laughs> Has it only been like two days? No, this is the second lesson. Your friend. So quick. Seems like it anyway. I don't know if this is wholly appropriate. That's why I always wanted a tutor. <laughs> <laughs> nice handsome man to teach me English. <laughs> Whoa! Look at his This fruit. is amazing! What? It's in his butt! <laughs> oh, he got shot in the butt! Oh no! <coughs> Such confidence. Yeah. She's playing her role. Are they like professional scammers? They're so yeah. good. They're so good. I like turn on. It's automatic. Yeah. It's ghosts. Oh. Huh. Mm. Nathan Park? Mm-hmm. Oh, these lights just coming on. I thought she screamed. There's a ghost behind her. No! Three dogs, three! <laughs> I love how confident they are. Yeah. In their scam. <laughs> but I don't know. She seemed like she knew what she was talking about. I don't know. As I'm wondering. Okay, now I don't know what's going on. Oh, they put the underwear in the car, make it look like something happened, fire, get him to drive the bill. Oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my. They're good. Their whole family's gonna. He must be a pervert. <laughs> in his boss's car. <laughs> Why not in his seat? Why cross the line? <laughs> oh my gosh. Like the woman wouldn't forget her panties. Sure. But the guy might forget to. Whatever if he did some like. Roofie. Mm -hmm. Oh man. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was great. Okay, so he's not putting that way. He's just saying, like, maybe she was high and she yeah. forgot him because of that. All right. I thought he was saying, like, what if he's, like, raping women in his car? No, nah, I sure. get what I mean. Yeah. Make noise. <laughs> <laughs> she swept everything off the table so fast. Mm -hmm. Tree doggos. How are they going to get rid of this lady? Right. Kidnap one of the dogs. <laughs> Poison the prunes. So they went to look at a car. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so he could learn how to. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Just learning this morning. <laughs> oh, he's learning the car. He might know the roads. Yeah. Peaches are a forbidden fruit. Why? Well, maybe someone is allergic. Because they look like a butt? 
다이언트에서 들은 바에 의하면 그 아줌마가 소심한 복수를 발리는 거야 온몸이 새빨개지고 호흡 곤란한 천식으로 난리가 난다네 Are they gonna kill this woman? This is a pretty crazy one. 제가 들으려고 들은 게 아니라 제가 들으려고 들은 게 아닌데 통화 내용이 또 들려오니까 어쩔 수 없이 저 아버지 지금 간다고 너무 막 여기 위에 올라가 있는데 그걸 Can you come down here? Yeah. 집에 다섯 명이 더 어린 애도 있는데 결에 관자가 부엌에서 설거지하고 음식도 만들고 침도 튀기고. Oh no! Is the whole family a con artist? Jeez. So when she gets there, she's gonna be sick. This poor lady, right? I mean, I feel bad for all of them. Yeah. But, uh, for some reason, especially this poor lady, because like she's actively involved in that kid's life. Yeah, no, she was she's still been, good. She's for been a good. Him. Like, she's like playing with them. She had an arrow on her head. Yeah, like she's like coughing and hacking. Oh no. Like I'm sure she loves that kid. Sure. Oh, my oh no! You gotta make it look like blood in there. Yeah. The music's so good. <laughs> it's so epic. It's like these a people symphony are, are... of con. Yeah. yeah. <gasps> That's so much blood. He just tossed it in the trash with it. And <laughs> 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 she's like, "Fuck." I don't know. If I sh- I Why don't I like it's rooting so for this. It's so funny. It's... <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> My gosh. Why? She's just blindsided by it all. Yeah. All because of damn peaches, man. Just make up like- some excuse. She lives there, right? Like that's her home. Yeah. I imagine, yeah. She's like a she's like a live-in there, housekeeper, like housekeeper or nanny, whatever. Jeez. Oh, looks good. <laughs> Dude, yeah. What if they just take their whole house? Like just take everything. I don't want to keep looking at Rick because I don't know what all he knows. But like, damn it, Rick. <laughs> Quit doing this to this family. <laughs> now we replace the father. <laughs> yeah, I know. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Well, they're on the family members now, right? Yeah, I think so. Whoa! Is that all VR stuff? Walkie talkies. <laughs> <laughs> careful! Oh, man. I don't know why I'm saying be careful. Like, they're gonna ruin this great thing that they have going on. They got a hell of a thing going on. They got a hell of a thing! It's like four Sawyers living together. My gosh. I'm lost. <laughs> They smell the same. They smell the same. Mm. She smells the same too. I'll do something about that nose. <laughs> to their patron, Mr. Park. No! Is he going to hit him with the rock? <laughs> I mean, that rock has blessed them. I know. They're gonna give blood to the rock. Okay. No! He's just pissing no! on you. He's Stop! Just... It's weaponizing it! He's pissing all over the place. Don't! No! It's a fight, no one wins. Don't put it on social media. Don't get caught. Oh, oh my it's God. slow motion! Whose water is it? No! Who's that? That's the dad. It's a day I think. Trying to catch the pee with all the extra water, push it back. No, there's the stream. The music is so beautiful. <laughs> no, he missed and got his son. Why? <laughs> I think I was turning to get him. <laughs> camping, camping trip, okay. Are they gonna take the house when they come back from the camping trip? Oh, you could just hang out in the sweet house. <laughs> Don't have much. <laughs> You just have a little bit from each other. What if they come yeah. home early? You know? Then you kill them and take their shit. It's raining. Their camping might be... Yeah, like, you know what? This sucks. We're going back. Yeah, that makes them come back. And then she's like, Huh? <laughs> 
Like the dog gonna eat. No. All right, now I don't like it. That's the point. These guys can't help but con. <laughs> it's puppy treats. She's been eating the candied big. Uh oh. Can. Uh oh. Uh oh. Clean everything. <laughs> right now. Huh? That's the former housekeeper. Oh, you got TV. No. She doesn't look great. She does not. Are they gonna have to kill this lady? <laughs> I, know, I don't know, Cal. I don't know what to expect. Me either. This isn't part of the plan. Maybe this lady helps him take the house. I don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> Cal, you said that. Lights didn't come on. You said that like. Is Wayne Brady gonna have to kill a bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Choke a bitch. That's what he said. Shit. What the hell? What's behind the cat? Money. Room? Riches. Honey? Honey? Is there a prison down here? What, what the fuck is, is going on? Did this shit just take a turn? Yeah, it took a turn. Where do you keep your honey? Okay, she's just looking for some honey from the bees. This is the beehive down here. And they were doing it to the family before them. She's been hiding someone down here? <laughs> Four years? Why? Okay, even the playing field now. This is a cluster of fucking shit going on right here. Yeah, it is. <sighs> it's two versus four, though. Uh oh. Oh, yeah, don't yeah. don't text it to the to the kid. <laughs> Man, just walk up. <laughs> I go upstairs like that sometimes. Yeah, I do too. too. I chase Obi like that. Man, I felt bad for this lady. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Oh, what if it accidentally sends? I don't know. Oh, who to, fuck. I don't know who to root on. What's gonna happen? Oh, so many fingers. I sent stuff by accident with my pocket. The dogs right? are coming. Poor puppies, they don't understand what's happening. I don't understand what's happening. These are attacking people. Peace, puppy. Break the phone. Peaches. Are they gonna attack her with peaches? They are! This is the craziest fight! Phone. Oh, no. Look who's coming home. Boil the water? That didn't take that long? No. Five minutes. Good shit. shit. Shit's gonna go crazy. Oh my gosh. Alright, improv, let's go. Oh, she doesn't even know how to make it. The guy is Google. You gotta clean get, everything. Get the sirloin out. They gotta clean. They gotta cook. They gotta murder. 
They do! <laughs> yeah, you go. Oh, no, get that upstairs. Yeah. Put in the right order. Fuck, duck, duck! Oh my god, it's so tense. I want them to be caught. They're terrible people, but I don't want them to get caught. Oh my gosh. Kick her. Kick her. <laughs> Kick her. <laughs> she dead. She's she dead. hit her head so hard on that wall. She did a flip on the stairs, Calvin. They kicked her. She might have broken her neck. <laughs> Ghost! You're right. It's a ghost! Ghosts! <laughs> ghosts! No fucking way. I was right, but I didn't know why. <laughs> I was right. <laughs> Can Ayla would do this? Oh my god! That's terrifying! <laughs> That's. I'm so fucking shook! I am so shook! He had seizures. I feel like she's probably dead. But I mean, I would die if I felt like that. But oh she, she's no! Dead. Intracranial bleeding. They've killed this woman. To guess that she has. I thought she was gonna. Oh, no, oh, she's not she's dead. Breathing. She's not dead. Thank she God. She will be dead. She's Let's tie her concussed. up while she's bleeding she and not be sleeping. She has and cranial bleeding. She's got. Peaches. She should be awake or she would die. An allergic reaction. Uh, Oh, no. Look at the puppy. That's such a happy puppy. Oh no, fucking, yeah, fucking Foo Foo's gonna give it all away. That's not Foo Foo. There's so many things to give it all away. <laughs> Mom made all the rom down? I think I'm just gonna hide all under the table? Okay. Yeah. Oh fuck, they're all hiding under the table. <laughs> Love this kid. They're all hiding under the table. Oh, fuck. My gosh. Thank goodness this table isn't like most tables. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> well, if they fall asleep, we can sneak out. What if they're heavy sleepers? What if they can't see under the table from there? Thank goodness this table's so big as well. Right? My brother, I could have fit down there. Three fully grown people. Table will just be like, move it. <laughs> It'll be wobbling. It'll be high center. Just pretend to be ghosts. Ooh. That only comes on his birthday. <laughs> oh god, this this day this day won't end. I <laughs> Walk doggy. Oh no! Oh no! Oh my gosh! <laughs> just no movement! He's just in the dark! <laughs> oh fuck! Crawl! Movement might draw attention. <laughs> fuck! Man, what a night. They killed a person. Well, yeah, there's Maybe still two people not. in the basement. I feel exhausted. I know, what a fucking scene. This is one scene. One unbreaking, oh my god. I love this picture. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most terrifying thing. Do this. <laughs> there's just those eyes coming up. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, what would men do? <laughs> He would have just been a tutor and that would have been it. Let's all quit. And just leave. They don't know who we are. Quit while you're ahead. It's flooding, it's man. Everything flooded. Oh shit, their house is flooded. The window. Man, she's alive. 
Oh, this how woman, man. throat hasn't closed up. <laughs> oh, uh, get out of that room! It's so hot. It's not important. Oh my gosh! I don't think it's helping. Leave! I think you just gotta get your shit and get out of the fuck out of there. Don't smoke that. Don't put it in your mouth. Material wealth. He's a scout. <laughs> Scouts knows Morse code. I mean, this would have happened to them yeah, like, regardless of anything, too, you know? Yeah, if anything, they're in a better position now. One that you don't tell anybody else about. They must be thinking, man, what a crazy night we had. I have no idea. Yeah. <sighs> well, maybe while they're all out there, they can deal with the stuff inside. Or not. They're dealing with stuff inside. Can I kill those people with a rock? What's he doing? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Mm, what a tall hat. <laughs> Quit dropping shit down those stairs. It's a hearty rock. It's okay. <coughs> Hands gonna come down. Or no one does because they're both dead. Wait, Morse codes himself to death? Maybe. Because his wife's dying. Bleeding. He's just banging the fuck out of his head until he can't do it anymore. He's unconscious down there, bleeding from his head. It's possible. All right, he's not dead. Now he can get out of here. Oh no! Oh no! Oh fuck! Oh my god! Uh, no, he's gonna grab you. Oh my gosh. dead. He looks like a ghost. Dude, that kid's gonna be so fucked up from his ghost. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Yeah. The hell did you educate with this? <laughs> he didn't. <laughs> He's gonna kill the Indian. <sighs> Kevin's dead. Yeah. There he goes into a seizure. He is. Oh my gosh! I figured the dad would snap somehow. These guests have to be like, what the fuck? Kevin? Kevin? <laughs> Brain surgery. Oh, 
CCTV camera got cut, that's right. Yeah. Don't touch anything with your bloody hands. It's a little piece of salmon every day. Okay. Buried her in the back. Uh, if I could, like, flush it down the toilet or something. He's the ghost now. Hmm. He's gonna buy the house. <laughs> How long? Pizza Tirolan Naden. Turn on the Warren Tony Sukio. I was in a canoe. Ketaman or Lausch meant him. They just move in, or is somebody moving out? Yeah, that was over. <laughs> that guy's gonna come piss again, isn't he? That pisser lives here now. <laughs> That's the plan. Mm -hmm. Sometimes the plans don't work out. Hmm. <sighs> Crazy ass movie. <laughs> Man, I wrote nothing. Didn't, that's my plan. You didn't write anything? <laughs> I was gonna read and try not to miss anything. What a fucking movie. Uh, and then you were like looking over here and it shows the sun <laughs> and the giant pool of blood. I'm like, I saw it. <laughs> I saw it. I miss it. I'm just, it just, yeah. I think it's better not knowing what it's about. Fuck yeah. I mean, once you realize, like, once the, the, the sister comes in, like, okay, you can kind of guess, like, they're going to just, I mean, they didn't, they were providing services, you know, but, yeah, you know, but under false pretenses. Genuine services. No, I get you. Like, she's not an art therapist. But that one guy was driving. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> you know, like, he one... was teaching English. She he was, was driving. Plus he was extra, cleaning the house. Yes. Hers is definitely the most questionable of all of them. Like, the yeah. other is like, well, they seem to be performing the services just fine. Yeah. It's just like they probably never would have been hired in that position because they didn't have the experience yeah. and the training. Oh, no, yeah. And like what he was saying, like, you know, we're lucky. Like, one job comes up and 5,000 college kids apply mm -hmm. for the position or whatever, 500 or whatever. Like, we are all employed. The odds of that happening... And they very low. Sure. Yeah, they, no, I it's, think it's why like you you kind of root on them too because you see them trying and then they're like, oh, these boxes aren't good enough and they're getting fumigated and all these things are going on. You're like, damn, this sucks. Oh man, look, they're getting well, like, well, these people are rich. They probably have some money to spare, but also like you're also like, scamming them and that's probably not great either. Parasite is such a great title. Yeah, yeah. I really yeah. like it because the the rich people aren't monsters. Yeah, sure. You know, they're not like bad people. They're a little. Callous, or like they don't concern They're themselves. Very privileged. Exactly. Yeah. What's yeah. that smell? Right. The smell thing is sure. the thing that's really kind of like the it's like the smell of people on the subway. Huh. Like he's more Only bothered. People ride the subway. You know. He's like more bothered uh, by the smell of the guy that he's rolling over, not the fact can, that he or his employees are dying. Sure. Like he yeah, can right? smell his class, something that you can't change yeah. about mm -hmm. yourself. Kind of like a yeah. I don't know but, if entitlement's the right word, but I, I, yeah. it's it's yeah. They come Classes, from the privilege, yeah. and they're up there, and they they have that like well, the down there people. Yeah. You know. But the thing I love about it is that okay, now I realize what's going to happen. They're going to replace, and they're going to live off of it. And I'm thinking like, okay, but what next? And I never would have expected a secret guy living in the basement. You know, <laughs> dude. And then everything just no. Fire. And I love that. Uh, I love that 
obvious, surprising but obvious, like, why put the details? She eats for two. Like, oh, that was a weird thing, but I didn't think about it at all. Why have the lights? I didn't, yeah, and the lights. I was like, there's a ghost! <laughs> <laughs> you know? You're just fucking wrong, but you were so really, close. <laughs> really well crafted, because just when I thought I know what's going to happen next, it would swerve. And then from that point on, that whole night and the whole next day, and it ended with just a fucking stabbing massacre. You know? It's so, it feels Tarantino to me. Comedy thriller. Comedy thriller. That's what it's called as a comedy thriller? Yeah, it's that, a dark comedy. That fucking works sure, for me. Sure, it's very I dark. Laugh, but, yeah. And it's very thriller. Sure, yeah. No, I, I was just like, as we kept going, I'm like, I don't know what to expect. And then we had to like, I did not expect this. I don't know what to expect next. It's like, they must die or something. I don't know. Like, I laughed and I was thrilled. It was just, <laughs> sure. Man. Great movie. That image of that guy coming up for food. Just. Well, that kid's eating cake. I love that. Fuck me up. <laughs> like, that's going to be my sleep paralysis demon now. <laughs> it really is, Just, man. I look down at the bottom of the bed and his j- eyes just come up like that. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Rick, how much of this movie were you, like, familiar with? You said, like, you did some academic stuff with it, or? Well, yeah, so, um, we would, like, pick scenes from movies and, like, dissect them. Mm-hmm. So, like, I had seen scenes from this movie. What scene? Like, like yeah, like, what were you um, familiar with, or, like, <laughs> well, what you knew of? Well, I, I've seen a lot of, like, the going up and down the stairs. Because that's supposed to represent, like, leaving, not the underworld, but, like, yeah. the unprivileged class mm-hmm. to, like... Moving up in the world, yeah. so like whenever Mr. Park comes up into his home, kind yeah. of thing, he's like leaving the the lobbies and coming into his realm, kind of thing. Yeah, so so like a lot of scenes with stairs and things like that. Dude, I personally, what after having watched this movie, I I truly believe that someone heard that story about. Did you ever hear that story about the homeless guy that was living in this person's house and they just never knew about it for years? Yeah, like they started with the end and worked their way backwards. Like, how'd that happen? <laughs> I thought it was interesting. Like this, there's an architect who made this house. He uh-huh. had this lady who worked in his house. He recommended this lady, and then the people that moved in just like, yeah, sure, I'll take that. All right. And then she just fed her husband down in the basement, who was hiding from debt collectors. Four years. Fed him with like a baby bottle. Yeah, I thought it was funny too. That she's like, you know, a lot of people have these bunkers in their house if they need to hide from like war or creditors. Yeah, North Korea <laughs> or creditors. <laughs> Oh man! Oh. No, yeah, it was. I'm sure her, Kevin was dead. I I want to rewatch. I don't. I want to know how they did and what method they did for her falling down those steps because it looked like she just went straight. Yeah. Like yeah. Boom, and then back into the wall. I like mean, there's a. Uh, it was a. Uh, there was a uh, jingle all the way. Yeah. Like there's a guy who does like that exact same thing, but it's. On flat ground, he falls backwards, and when he pushes himself back up, he just stays like stiff, and then falls down again. Yeah. But I'm like, man, to do that on the steps, well, seems crazy. And, and like, like how they do that? It's not really. We don't really see it, of like the rich people keeping the poor people down. It's like the poor people are at each other's throats. Mm-hmm. Sure. And like the poor person kicks the other poor person down the stairs. Yeah. Sure. To keep them down. To keep or... them down so that they can keep what little thing they have. Like you have been like. The, the the maid lady, the housekeeper, has been like thriving on, you know, eating off of keeping her husband safe, taking the money, taking the food, for, and taking care of them. It, she was like kind of like I guess the parasite, and now these people came in and they start being the parasite, and now they're fighting. Right, they're fighting the for a host's body. Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say like it's like those birds on those that's... rhinos or hippos, whatever it is, where it's like they're fighting each other so they can get the fucking. Well, what's the uh, well, what's the uh, Sorry, I'm... no, it's okay. What's the fish saying? that replaces the tongue of another fish, and it would just eat. The stuff the fish tries to eat. Yeah. Like, that. Hmm. like the, the point of a parasite is to to live off a host's body, but once the parasite grows so far, he's to find like, a new one, a new host. Well, it it kills the host. <coughs> yeah. Because oh, it's sure. it's they're not. It's not like a s- subsistence. Like they they don't equally get the same amount. Sure. It's not a symbiotic relationship. Symbiotic, that's what I was trying to yeah. think Or if you get a parasite, like in this situation, it's like there were too many parasites for yeah. the ecosystem to thrive that everything just exploded, you know? Yeah, with just the maid and her husband, it would have been okay. Yeah. But then there was this other family that came in that replaced all the staff and stuff, but then there's still the maid and the, the guy down in the basement. I'm still thinking about a lot of it as like just face value, but I'm sure there's tons of meaning versus just like 
poor people are parasites. You know what I mean? Like, there's well, so many different things that you can. Like, I take thought this was about like, like a winter. disease or something. Sure, yeah. <laughs> that guy that was pissing, who was like this, and the one guy came up and he's like, oh. I was like, oh no, oh, fucking, oh shit. And then the one guy, the one guy started reaching for his stomach and stuff. And I'm like, oh my god, he's laying it on the table. Yeah, yeah the like sun. right afterwards. I'm like, oh my god, what is this? They were fuming. And then they were fuming. You know, like, yeah. like I had no idea what to expect for this movie, and like I just kept changing. But like I'm just thinking, I'm trying to think too now of like meanings of different things like I like the idea of like the stairs and what those mean and like the idea of like well it's you know the rich people were just doing their stuff but it was the poor people who were like fighting amongst each other to get what they could kind of thing too and keep yeah. each and, other and, down and you know, whatnot it's, just, it's and, easier to relate to the poor people it's like well sure they're they're way worse in this movie than the rich people were sure but like it's just easier to relate to those and like the movie's sure. able to get away with it I feel like yeah yeah because it, it presents it in not really a, a biased way. Like, the poor people are, are living their lives. You know, they're just trying to live a better life, do more for themselves. And they see this this life of, you know, lying and, and forgery and fraud and, you know, having people fired and stuff like that. They're just, they're trying to make their existence better. Yeah. It doesn't really explain their poorness. No. It doesn't like, well, you know, they don't want to work or Mm -hmm. like... Sure, did something terrible happen, thus the guy lost his job? I thought it was weird that at one point he mentioned like, you know, when you have a plan, like, things can go bad. Whether you kill someone or betray your country. I'm like, betray your country? Sure. Like, I I understand if you think about killing someone because he just possibly killed the one woman, you know, or tied her up and left her to die. But I was like, the Betray Your Country one felt very specific. And I wonder if there was, like, a history there. They talk about the one kid being in the military or something at some point and knowing English because of it. Well, like, as, as we learned from Squid, uh, Game. Squid Game, there is compulsory service. military service for all young men. Sure, but I, I don't know what to count as far as, like, I don't, I don't know Korea, and I don't know what universes are real. <laughs> like... <laughs> That could be... Uh, sometimes it's like, okay, well, what is in this universe and what's not? And what is... Because like, sometimes you get shows like, oh, this is in the U.S. Like, well, this isn't really how the U.S. is. Yeah. But then sometimes it is this is how the U.S. is. Or it's over-embellished version of how the U.S. is. Sure. Or under-embellished. But, like, I wonder... <laughs> so I, I, I wasn't thinking about it being like, oh, well, he must have been. It was just like, well, they told us he was in it. But, and something I don't know because I don't know the culture is, like, if you're rich enough, do you... Are you exempt? Kind of thing. Sure. Like, sure. can you buy your way out and, yeah. like... like the, Mr. Park. Like, yeah, was he in the military? Or his friend? Like his friend is a university student and seems to be a little more well to do. Like, yeah. did he also go through that? Sure. Like not? he didn't mention that when we were in the military. Yeah. Thing. He just said about you had this, you had that. But like, as far as like any information, there's not too much backstory on them for like, you know, did they lose their job because of X? You know, did, you know, how long have they been in this house? Is there a reason that? They can't get out. I mean, we just see, like, here's these poor people. They're trying to fold these boxes quickly to get money. They messed it up. They're getting penalized. They're trying yeah, like, to find a job. The daughter, at least, seems to have skills. Yeah. You know, like, are there just not enough jobs to go around? Is sure. Because of where she's from, like, like if you're <coughs> uh, kind of like a lost, right? Like, if you're poor and you have that smell, yeah. like, people just don't want you. Mm-hmm. Sure. Or it's just like you're competing against 500 people for one job, and those odds aren't great. No, yeah. You know? Like, that's just hard anyway. Population yeah. versus job demand. Or job supply. And general. they said, yeah. like, they weren't <laughs> The eligible. demand is very high. Yeah. They said they weren't eligible for, like, basic income or something as well. Uh, well yeah, the, national... The, the guy did. The guy in the basement. Yeah, he right. wasn't eligible for the national whatever. Because of his debt, maybe? It possibly. Probably. It could be. It's like, oh, well, you have this debt, so you can't qualify or something. I don't know how it works. But it just, it, for me, it's those things are, some of those are like, I don't know how this works. Like, in Korea, do they say that you have the right to remain silent? Like, is that just, is that something you do all over the globe? <laughs> or I imagine they're different words, but a similar yeah. idea, you know? Sure. So, like, I'm like, is that what they're really saying, or are they saying something else? Or is it just like, well, this is what we say, so let's just put those in there for dumb Americans. <laughs> you know? Well, and the, the rich people also seem to like, not worship, but like America is a high class thing. Yeah, like this sure, was sure. made in America, yeah. so it's not going to leak. Yeah. Yeah, and this, like, this university student went to Illinois. Illinois. Yeah. It's like, oh. Which is like, 
and Illinois the mother, State University. It's right over there. Like, if you just say that around here, I was like, oh, I went to Illinois State. It's like, cool, you yeah. know? Yeah. It's usually when you say things like Yale and Harvard, Harvard and, yeah. yeah, like, stuff like oh. that. Like, oh, yeah. whatever, you know? Like, that's a bigger college or something. And the mom, like, just throws in random English words every now and then. I wonder if that's, like, a posh thing. Probably. It shows, like, a higher education, probably. It could be. Like a... F- even, even if it's not, like, a real... Like, if she doesn't really, it's just... It's a fake. Yeah. She, like, know. she's putting on airs kind of thing? Yeah, kind of. Yeah, because, I mean... I we say French words in the middle of our English sentences, you know? And True. It puts an air on... I, we, like, we have a certain... What is it? Je ne sais... Je ne sais quoi. Je ne sais quoi. Yeah. Je ne sais quoi. Yeah, it has a certain je ne sais quoi about it, you know? Yeah. And, like, that's just, like... Why do you do that? <laughs> ah, it's just a saying. I feel like, uh... Filmmaking, I feel like, is a somewhat universal language. Sure. Like, I can understand some of the symbolism and the metaphors, I think, but I do wonder what I'm missing out culturally. Sure. Especially for a comedy. Yeah. Like, there's definitely... I, I know I'm I'm not knowledgeable enough on certain things to know I grasp everything about it. My first watch through is probably very face value of it and be like, I can't believe what these people are doing. So I, well, I'm rooting on them, and now I'm not. <laughs> oh, man, I can't believe... Because I'm, I'm like... At first, when he did the thing and then brought in the sister or whatever, I'm like, well, that's kind of clever. You can get some extra income for your family. All right, cool. And then she did the panty thing. I'm like, oh, my God. You're going to get this guy fired so your dad can get the job. And then when they're like, ah, let's just use these allergies. <laughs> like, you're going to kill this woman so your mom can get a job. Yeah. <laughs> like, I can't believe it. And then that woman comes back. I'm like, oh, this poor woman. Look at her face and all this shit from the allergies and yeah. who I don't know is she living on the street I don't know what she's doing you know and then she comes in and is like honey I'm like what yeah I wonder like and how they start long, trying to kill each other well like how long had it had been like was she not able to get medical treatment and that's sure. why she still looked like that that is one thing where like it, there is kind of like in a little bit of it I don't know how long it's is been is there a day like did he have one class with her for English then brought in the girl before his next class. Yeah, I don't know. And then she was there for a day. And then yeah, they it fired felt like them. it had to have been longer. Right? I mean, you would think, yeah, but maybe definitely. not. It'd be I so, it'd be so sus- not suspicious, but it couldn't have been like, too long though, because not too the, long. Because then the woman shows up for her husband who hasn't yeah. eaten in days. I'm saying like ninety sure. days. I don't think it can be that long. That husband would be dead. <laughs> I mean, they did have a refrigerator down. He snuck there. up, so she had been like giving yeah. bits and food that she had made, but she also said like, yeah, "No, yes. I took." I took money out of, like, my paycheck to buy him food. So, like, yeah. he had a store down well, there. And then also, like, right? the first three, you could have a lot longer of them actually doing it than once the woman gets tuberculosis. Yeah. <laughs> sure. With the hot sauce. That's true. I can't believe they did. <gasps> <laughs> <That's amazing. laughs> so funny. Like, when that was going on, I'm like, these guys can do so no wrong. wrong. Like, they're so good. I know. Like, nothing, like, like, I was like, there's going to be no tension in this film because they can just get away from everything. <laughs> but on, on your previous question, many countries have adopted a version of the Miranda rights, like sure. legal counsel and you know, not talking and stuff like that. Yeah, when they were saying that and going but through that, But it was like, like word for word Man, almost. that's word for word. Yeah. It seems weird that it's word for word. I was like, I, I was in my mind, I'm like, did they take it from us? Did we take it from them? Or are they like... Well, here's what their words are, but because it's in English, I'm going to assume everyone's going to be sure. familiar with this one. We're just going to say these ones that in, people yeah, know. In, they know these already. You know? In Korean, like, would an average Korean citizen recognize those as those Miranda warnings? Sure, yeah. But yeah, like, is they that what translated they say in the it, street? Yeah, but they translated it to word-for-word English so that we would recognize it as the Miranda warning. Sure, right? yeah. I, I was, was trying to look up just some trivia, too. Uh, the craziest being that this one, Best Picture, Best Director original screenplay, and uh, best international feature, and then it was nominated for film editing and production design. Like, it just fucking cleaned up at the Oscars, so good for it. I really enjoyed this movie. One guy won three of those, right? Yeah. (laughs) It does... It it feels like a a movie that I've not really seen before. Yeah. You know? Like, there's definitely some things where it's like, you know, trading places, it's messing with the idea of, like, the rich versus the poor. Prince and and the pauper. Yeah, what it means to be poor and stuff, but, like, you know, I didn't know what to expect, and it was, like, kind of toying with the idea a little bit more than, like, yeah. what I'm used to, I guess. You know, it felt more original, so I'm glad it got the original side of it. Yeah, like, I feel like Squid Games might have taken some stuff from this. Mm-hmm. Possibly, yeah. Uh, a cool piece of trivia here. Specifically, we were talking about, like, translating from there to, to us. Uh, Ramdan, the dish that uh, is asked to prepare, 
uh, as they're returning from the camping trip. It's actually a term invented specifically for this film by subtitle translator Darcy Paca. Paca? Uh, combining the names of the noodles used to make it, uh, ramen, ramen and udon, uh, he felt the dish's actual name, Jagapaguri, would be too difficult for English speakers to understand. The beef that is asked to be mixed is called Hansu, one of the most expensive meats in the world, uh, which serves as a complimentary disc uh, that they add premium beef to the dish regarded as a budget comfort food. So they wanted to be able to... Uh, do, I don't know. I, I thought that was interesting that Ramdan was invented by the subtitle so that we wouldn't necessarily recognize it. It feels like hoity-toity to us a little bit. Sure. sure. Yeah. Well, when yeah. she was cutting up the, the beef, I was like, ooh, that's yeah. a good marbling. <laughs> I sure, could tell. Yeah. But they would add this so they crazy beef to this budget comfort food. Expensive steak yeah. into ramen noodles, yeah. basically. Yeah. yeah. And it's like, ah, oh, yeah, it's a comfort food that we enjoy. We're really slumming right now. Mm-hmm. And the, it's the idea, too, of like, yeah. you know, you might have some foods that like maybe you just have a nickname for at home or something like that. Yeah. You just call something different, sure. you know? It's like, well, I don't know, we just call this... You know, Melanie makes a thing that I'm sure has some name, but we call it chicken thing. Yeah, you chicken know? thing. You call it chicken thing. It's like, well, make your chicken thing, and it's like a salsa, pepper. It's like a, it's almost like a like a mex dish kind of thing, because it has like that salsa stuff, whatever. But you got chicken in it, and you just take it, toss it in tortillas, eat it by itself, whatever. You know, sounds good. But we just call it chicken thing. The uh, table, not, not the not. the. The big table, they table hit under? was specifically made for the film so they could fit three people. Yep. Dude, I was like, I can't believe this table is so big. Yeah. It fits them all under it, and yeah. people can't see them. Yeah. And you uh, couldn't do that under our dining room table. No, well, it's no, just too high. No, it's too way. high. But like, yeah. but even if it wasn't, yes. if it were lower, you still couldn't. Yeah, I've had other. You like, have to crouch under it. I've had three. coffee tables, and I'm like, I can just see under that. You mm-hmm. know, like. Yeah. This thing was made in... gigantic. It wasn't like their couch was sitting up high. Yeah. I was like, man, they're going to lay on the couch. You're going to see them. Yeah. But they didn't. But it was close enough to where even if you laid down on the couch, you couldn't see far enough underneath well, the table. And that could also be metaphorical, too. Where, like, the rich don't see the poor. Sure. You know well, what? The, I, they just don't don't even recognize them. Don't even yeah. process that they're there. Sure. Well, and also the, the, the house itself was designed for the film. It's not like a house they filmed in. They designed it in a way so that he could pose shots so that... The parks were over here, and the parasites were over here, and there was like very clear lines between them. So they they they, they designed the house and they gave it to an architect to say like, hey, is there anything here we can make it look more real? And the architect said, this is the most ridiculous house I've ever seen in my life. There's nothing I can do for it. <laughs> so they're like, all right, fuck it, <laughs> just build it like it is. Yep. Wow. So they because they did it for specific shots. Sure. To separate these two. Sure. But also there was a cool piece of trivia in there that pointed out that. Despite the parks, you know, being at this higher class, they still also can't be whole people. They require, like, a servant to do their things. Mr. Park sure. needs yeah. the driver. She needs the housekeeper, uh, the art well, therapist, the, Mr. the, Park the English. Mr. Park talked about how, like, uh, in a week our house will be a trash can. Yeah. You know? yeah. My wife's yeah. not a housekeeper. Sure. And then you see her later on. She's, like, pulling the dishwasher thing. Things are falling out and stuff. Yeah. And, yeah. So they I have to but, parasite their own stuff. You but know? then it also felt like, too, like they were playing poor like there was a thing when like they were doing their sexual stuff yeah where he's like you put those cheap panties yeah. on she's like buy me drugs buy me drugs yeah. like is this supposed to be like oh we're poor yeah. and we're pretending yeah. to yeah, like role playing yeah. stuff and, like, it. I was like it's like we're right. dirty because at first I thought she was like oh man his wife wants drugs <laughs> <laughs> like I was with my head first because it's like I'll put on those panties if you buy me drugs and I was like huh yeah but then the more you kind of think about like like they're just kind of like, yeah, adding something else to it. Because I was also curious on every time Mr. Kim kind of mentioned, like, ah, but you love her, right? And there's like this weird tension on that thing there, too, where it's like, well, what's this about? Mm-hmm. Like, he's yeah. doing things for his kids, but is it more of his kids? Does he not love his wife? He's like, we'll call it love. And I'm like, is it just like she's hot? So, like, eh, yeah, I love her. I don't, I don't know. I was like kind of curious there on like what they were going for a little bit. So, I mean, it could also be that like, between the family themselves, there's an amount of, like, parasitic nature. Like, you know, she handles all of the the household affairs. You know, sure. he, he doesn't have time to mess with that. So, yeah. like, he pushes that off on her. You know? Yeah, sure. Many stages of... I'm sure there's a lot of things that I'm not thinking about that they did. And... Yeah, I didn't like the use of, like... You know, this stone will give you material wealth, and he was literally going to take it 
to take that wealth, you know, to get rid of this guy. And it's the thing that was used to take stuff from him, take his father, take his sister. Sure. And then, obviously, I don't think that he ever will buy that house. <laughs> well, it was like, that's that was, the plan, <laughs> and the plan doesn't work. That was one thing, too, is like, the way it ended, like, at first I thought it ended, and then it came back. Yeah. And I'm like, I think that if you, if you cut off that last scene, you have one ending. And if yeah. you keep that scene, you have an entirely different ending. Yeah. You yeah. know? Just based on the way it goes. Because, like, you kind of... You go there, you see it, you see him come out, you see that whole thing. And if you just cut there, you're yeah. like, all right, oh, well, man, it works he made out. It. Like, how the fuck right? does he even get that message to his dad? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. think he does. It might you not know? be, right? Like, he's yeah. writing... That's the plan, and then... He's writing what the plan is, and yeah. as his dad said before, plans... When you when you make a plan, things start spiraling, and... Life never end. goes to plan. Yeah, so... Yeah, you can never fail if you don't make a plan. Yeah. Which I did, like... I like that. Like, I thought that was an interesting thought process that he had there. It was just like, you know. But he's also like, you just roll with it. Yeah. So, I don't know. It was definitely, yeah, I don't know. I feel like there's a lot to, like, if you watch it again, I think you pick up different things. Oh, yeah, things, I want to watch like, it again. Notice different aspects. and. I want to watch this with Carmen. <coughs> yeah. She's going to hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to love it. <laughs> I feel like, yeah, like, Go into it not knowing anything, and you're like, oh, I wonder what this is. Oh, yeah, it's about this poor family, or... And I think probably, too, like, what was the last... Besides Squid Game, we did Train to Busan, and mm-hmm. that one was, like, a horror thing. Yeah, so I'm watching this being like, oh, man, what's this going to be? What we yeah. Parasite, what's yeah. Parasite? You Parasite know? sounds, sounds like, creepy. Yeah, it sounds like that one... And I swear, that one guy, there was the fumigation, and the one guy with his stomach, I'm, oh, my God, what's going to I thought it was going to be, like, pandemic or something. Yeah, I don't know sure. what I was thinking. Yeah. Of. And it wasn't that at all. And I'm like, oh, man, okay, well. And then it wouldn't come for two years. But <laughs> never I was like, the lights, the ghost! And then, <laughs> and then they'd have a thing, she, ah! I'm like, the ghost! <laughs> and so, oh my she kicked gosh. her down the stairs. Uh, <laughs> we're not watching our Cobra Kai reactions. Oh, uh, yes. Kick her! Yeah, no, that culminates a lot. <laughs> Kick her! Okay. Yeah, it was really good. I, I was just... Huh. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I resorted to murder much quicker than this family... I did. Of con artists, they definitely didn't <laughs> want like that wasn't even like an option. It felt like well, we're not gonna kill him. Not for the mom and the daughter, but we're the, just con. But the son was going down there with a rock. Yeah, sure. Do you think the dad was planning that, that too? I mean, that he, damn he, kid he fucked plans. up everything. You know why? One, he slipped his foot, fell down the stairs, knocked everyone down. Yep. Two, took the rock down there, dropped the rock, <laughs> lost the sense of a surprise. He's also the one that got them the opportunity in the first place. <laughs> yeah, know, but he shouldn't. But he been also there. opened that that shelf. Where they were trapped down there before, they didn't have the crank. Yeah. Like, they were just going to stay down there until the dad did his plan. We could have dealt with it later, right? 100% yeah. would not have let that lady in the house. No. Fuck no. I, I would have said, tell me what it is, I'll be like, and I I'll go get it for you. Mr. and Mrs. Park first. Yeah. 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 Right? Yep. Easy. Gone. Easy. Yep. And then, yeah, then she'd be gone. And she can ding that bell as many times as she wants. It doesn't matter. Or you say... All right, what is it and where is it? I'll go down and get it for you. Yeah, that's, you know? that's what I said. Well, if you can't tell me, I can't let you in. You're locked out. We're fine. Yeah, because at that point, she doesn't suspect anything nefarious. No. She's no. just worried about her husband. Yeah. It's when the other three tumble down the steps. And it's like, oh, if, oh, you're doing this too. And if she you son of a bitch. If she doesn't tell you much, oh, the husband's down in the basement. She just says, like, oh, it's just a bag down in the basement. Yeah. Please just let me in. And like, oh, well, well, I'll talk to them make sure. Was, I guess it... I tried to relate if I was a con person and I had this, person. and I was that desperate and that person started taking a video of me as I fell but what would I do they were also all drunk they were all drunk Which you're right help. you're right and curious curiosity killed like they ran and got peaches to attack that woman like that was <laughs> Man, insane I know that was so insane he did Man. <laughs> like apparently all the heavy objects around the room and you run to the fridge to get peaches apparently the director when he was a kid, he had a friend that said they had a peaches allergy. He didn't believe him. He's like, Pe- no one's allergic to peaches. So he went to a grocery store, got peaches, and threw it at him. And the guy, or the girl, like, broke out in allergies. And he's like, oh, oh no. shit, I feel terrible. Now, I don't remember this. <laughs> I'm going to use this in one of my films. And then oh, at the shit. Oscars, they asked him, of all your movies, is this your best one? He said, no, my next one is. I'm like, that's a baller ass. <laughs> it's a baller ass thing to say. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because you watch this one, then you're yeah. done. It's like, oh, he came out with another one? Oh, yeah. He said this one was his best. I'm not going to watch that one. He also said that he wished he could turn in the best director Oscar so that they could, the film editing and production design would win because he felt like 
it's so rare that Korean industry gets recognized. He wanted the crew to win, not him. Mm-hmm. Right. So. Sure. No, it's just it's very interesting going through where I'm like, maybe it's a horror movie. Yeah. And then they get to the whole thing where it's uh-huh. like, oh, you're gonna teach English, and I'm okay. And they did yep. that. They did the pulse thing and stuff. Yeah. Like, Maybe we're maybe we're gonna go into something else. Maybe more of like a romance, and maybe more of like a yeah, you know, like I don't yeah. know. And, and I think it's hard to understand that it's a comedy because it's in a different language and a sure. different culture. You know, sure. sure. I mean, I mean the the slow motion of the guy pissing on him and throwing water on him. I mean, stuff. I said it during Train to Busan, but it, it is strange how like comedic timing and editing seems so universal. Like just good editing, yeah. you can feel it in your heart as opposed to trying to understand a language really cool yeah this definitely had great editing Mm -hmm. like it lingered on some shots so long like that one where the dad was laying down on the ground near the couch towards (sighs) the uh, I was like ah just scoot scoot a little bit just scoot and it just stayed there (laughs) other than the one scene with like you know they just had like strings building tension the music was good the music was great but I felt like it wasn't like you know sometimes you watch like a horror movie Mm -hmm. and it's just and I'm like, you can appreciate that, but I would personally sometimes feel like, all right, you're, you're pushing me too hard. Right. But there were like whole scenes in here with no music sometimes, yeah. or just kind of like a classical sure. sound where like it was like she was it setting was, up the tables in the yard. Yeah. Where like, it was like that was it's, really it's, great. It's building in a way that I feel tricked, not tricked, but not tricked into tension. I'm just feeling tension artificially. Yeah. Or, uh, naturally, I mean. Which I enjoyed that. Yeah. I completely said the wrong thing twice. Because <laughs> in the back of your mind, like, those people are still down in the basement. Well, what are you going to do about the people? You know, you watch Scream or, you know, a, a horror movie where it's like, huh, 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 huh. And then they, they get yeah. you, you know, and you're like, I expect it. Did you just do home improvement as your example? <laughs> bow, 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 for horror movies? <laughs> no. No, like, they would build tension with music yeah. and then say, like, and now here comes the Scream. And then the Scream comes and you're like... I mean, for me, at least, I'm like, oh, okay. You don't watch that horror movies. That's not what they do, Eric. Oh, no, it they, happens. They build it up. Sure. And then they go, bah! And it's not the thing. And then when they're they like, ah! I know, it doesn't give me You were wrong! I'm going to run upstairs. I'm like, fuck! You uh, know, it's, so, it's funny when I watch horror movies with Melanie and stuff, because I'm sitting there, I'm like, all right, here it comes. Yeah. And then, yeah. jump scare. And, real scare. <laughs> yeah. And then she's sitting there, ah! <laughs> oh, is that an open medicine cabinet? Hmm. Yeah. Close the door. <laughs> Every time. There was, oh, wait, there's nothing in there. Ah! <laughs> there was a moment in this where, like, the music had such tension uh-huh. during something. I can't remember what it was, but it it was, like, adding the extra tension at, like, a like a weird moment. I yeah. forget what it was. See, I just watched There Will Be Blood for the first time. There's not a lot of blood in that movie. Well, there's not, but I, I really like it. I think it's a great movie. But actually, at least my first time watching I didn't like the soundtrack. <laughs> Because it's creating ten, like tense sound, a hundred percent away from the movie, and I just like felt exhausted after a while. You know, sure. um, I, I, I thought moments would have played better just completely silent, as opposed to like, especially the opening. This felt very like, I don't know. There was moments of that where this succeeded and that failed for me. I can understand that. Like, I watched a horror movie. I can't remember what it was named, but it was like this high school play that went wrong like 10 years ago and a kid actually like got hung on stage and then like his his, like relative or something came back and they were going to do the play again but then he like hung the whole cast of the play or something like that and it was just tense music all the way through it just ruined it because like there's no highs and lows no you need you need the calming down period so that you can feel the the spike again just it's monotone right yeah exactly it was just yeah it got old really quick. I did love The Ruby Blood, by the way. It was a great, fantastic movie. Yeah. I didn't like them. That was my own that I, movie that I watched. I've never actually seen it. No, it's very good. I just know there's not a lot of blood in it. Well, Daniel Day Lewis is <laughs> just watched, like a... Which I think is so ironic for... Oh, oh there's some. <laughs> there's some. Uh, there's not a lot, though. I mean, I guess there is some, but they, they tell you that... The, the Having watched a the movie... They don't I say would, there will be a lot of blood. There's enough. <laughs> they don't say there will be a lot. They just say there will be some. Yeah. Ooh, there is certainly blood. That's what they should have called it. <laughs> there, there is certainly, certainly blood. blood. <laughs> this is more oil. Uh, yeah, great movie. I really enjoyed it. It's you know I, it came out in 2019, but I'm seeing it here in 2022. My favorite movie of the year so far. Don't say anything that it's only the 11th. Guys, thanks so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this, make sure you subscribe as we watch movies like every week, and also vote on future movie options that we have. 
go over to patreon.com slash blindwave. You can find polls there every other week for new movies, as well as our early access movies available there as well. And full length. The sky will forever haunt me. Gotta put a lock on my